on a side note my body's done and I thought I would show it to you guys truck and everything it looks pretty bomb I like it, it looks good Side note, we started to add the decals to the grasshopper body. So that's starting to come along nice, very cool. So the car is really dirty right now and I thought I would show you guys how I do it. So what I do is I take a brand new bottle of alcohol and I put one of these little spray nozzles on it, okay? Alcohol is safe to use except for on the plastic but we're not going to let it sit long enough to get it but it will get that kind of shit out so we just hit the truck with it just hit the whole thing with alcohol okay whole thing especially the bearings and shit want to hit all that with alcohol all right so you just put alcohol all over it now you can use this stuff it's a foam cleaner now this stuff I would only recommend on the front here don't get it near the electronics or anything, but you can put it on the back and stuff like that. All right, and then you can use the alcohol to wash it off if you like. And then, air compressor, baby. All right, and then I take a paper towel and I just kind of Go over the truck with it. Everything that I can touch with the paper towel, I will. Especially these dirty spots. Those just wipe right off. See that? Nice and clean. Get that shock tower. Shocks. Yeah, get it nice and clean. Whoa, it's slippery. Yeah, you just uh, go like that all right until you're satisfied with it and then a next step that I'll use is this this is electric cleaner and what I do with electric cleaner is is I spray it inside the motor here And what that does is blow any dirt or grime out of the bearings and I do it here too do it to the whole truck anywhere that there's a bearing you want to spray it out okay anywhere that there's a bearing use this electric motor cleaner and spray that out all right then you can take your compressed air and then you you blow out the bearings okay blow all that crap out of there it off really good you do not want any of that alcohol left behind all right make sure you spray as much as the truck off as you can get all that residual alcohol out of there okay now once that's done then what we do is we take some 3-in-1 electrical motor oil, same stuff, it works great for bearings and everything else, and then right in here, we just put a little, see, like that, make it nice and shiny, 
and then we'll come over here do the other side put a little oil in it there we go good 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 okay now let's do the backs the best way to do the backs is to turn the truck on its side and then we'll do the backs like that get those in there Now what I do is I take me a chamois or some kind of cloth. Put a little bit of the oil on that. And then that is what I use to polish up the aluminum. Now, once you oil the car up, right? right like you you go over everything with the oil it's best to let that dry don't just take your truck back out because that oil is going to make everything stick to it but yeah that's that's basically how I clean my truck and then I go back over it with an oil rag and grease up everything make everything shiny and cool looking because the the alcohol kind of leaves like a, a gray film on it and you don't want none of that so you just polish it all up nice and neat this is how I clean my tires especially really dirty ones hit them with this foam real good You want that all over that. I want it all over it. Then I turn on the hose, which at this current time, I actually have a pressure washer hooked up to it, but I can just use the nozzle. See? And then I set the tires out to dry in the sun. I hope this helps you guys, but that's how I clean my stuff. Isabel. Come on, baby. I see your ass. Yeah, you. I see you. Come on. Get out of the hole. Oh, my God, dude. You got to be... Ease about. Come on. Get out. Get out. Come on. Come on. Come here. Oh my God. She got all of this dug out underneath here. You little rascal.